If you have been paying any attention to the psychedelic space of late, then you probably would have heard of magic mushrooms capability to cure of anxieties. But how exactly does this occur on a neurochemical level? Let's find out. Of course, before we know the cure, we need to know the condition. And so the first thing to understand about anxieties, be it social anxiety or general anxieties of many different sorts, is that the root cause behind all of them is something known as a conditioned fear response. Now, a CFR for short, comes about when somebody has previously found themselves in a fear or anxiety inducing situation, such as past traumas, as a more serious example, or even lesser examples such as embarrassing or humiliating situations. These happenings essentially train or condition a person to react or act in a way that previously helped them to manage or mitigate the situation when it was happening, such as remaining silent, pointing their eyes to the ground when experiencing abuse from partners or parents, or chewing their nails as a stress release. All habits which are all now perceived as signs of social anxiety, and are habits which are no longer needed, now that the fear-inducing event has passed, but still linger in the form of rigid and familiar habits. Essentially what common psychedelics like magic mushrooms do is they raise neuroplasticity as well as entropy within the mind, allowing for these rigid habits to dissolve or melt away. A clean slate, basically, where the mind is finally free to move on without being encumbered by previous events, traumas, mishaps, or whatever may have caused the anxieties in the first place. On top of this, the neurogenesis, or growth of new brain cells, which psilocybin containing mushrooms is known to induce, also promotes courage, as well as curiosity within the person, meaning they enter new situations in life, curious, brave, and keen, rather than anxious.